Wow, it's getting light. Perhaps it should be more clear. It's Tuesday, the 20th of February 2018, and it's getting light. Time 0633 hours, Greenwich Mean Time. I think spring is on the way. However, it is a bit breezy and it's a bit cold. Frost. Got leave. Had leave yesterday, today and tomorrow. Newport today, Cardiff tomorrow. And if I'm in a good mood and I can do it, possibly Panath on Saturday. Depends on plumbing situation. Okay. Um. Yeah. So it's light, but because we are approaching the end of February, there is a weather bomb on the way. I don't think it's snow, but it's going to be mighty cold, which is horrible. Never mind. Or oh, you can drink coffee to keep me warm. Not worrying, not worrying, not worrying about colour balance, because daylight. And the weather's going to be a festival that's coming out soon, and this is the from abroad but brewed in the UK. This is brewed by Admins and it's called Mr. Feathers. 4.9% alcohol by volume and UILTJE Brewing Co. How the hell you pronounce that? Nah, not really. So, Hoppy Red Ale. I can smell the hops. Mmm. Fruity. Hoppy. Very fruity finish. Fruity four. Nice, gently bitter. B plus in a bit, I think. There is a breeze. It's also summer. I was going to say, new tables, and then I thought Queen's Hotel had new tables, and I also saw that the Tom Toyer Lewis is closing down, which is a shame. Anyway, Punk IPA, you know what it's like, I'm not going to be bothered rating it, and um, waiting for Jim and Miss Pitchfork to come on. Oh, may not. I might just go straight over to the... Um, Pen and wig. They'd open at, I think they'd open at 10. For an hour. I'll spin this out. I didn't stay. I might go back though. This is still Tuesday. Oh, I don't know. The decisions I have to make. Anyway, fine ales. Carry on. Ah. <coughs> uh, no music, which is good. <sighs> um, Gatlin's Law, a well-known New Zealander with Welsh connections. New Zealand IPA. Ooh, you would have thought, actually, let's have a look. 4.2% alcohol by volume from Tenby Harbour Brewery. I mean, the Tenby, yeah. Uh, I need to do it. It's a bit cold. <laughs> so far, not so good. It's hoppy, but I'm going to let it warm up a bit. Well, it's sunny, but there's a chill wind. However, we shall soon be having chips. Shelter from the wind. Let's have some collabs. Happy sixth birthday, Tiny Rebels. Okay, so not this year. Which is a shame. This is Cheeky D. I don't think it's a collab. A Vimy's Sour. Uh, something Vinto. It's 4% back. 
focus on excellence by volume. Could be, could focus on alcohol by volume. Oh, it's very big toy. Refreshingly sour, but totally sour. That's a big plus plus. Oh, brew fast, I'm gonna miss you. Anyway, weighing in at 7%, and it's a good job we just asked for a half. Cola with fierce beer, orange mocha prop stout. Yes, uh, I believe so. The brewers having a chat with them at the moment, they're from Scotland, probably from Wales with all Celts. Wow, huge aroma of coffee. Blows your head off. Coffee B plus plus. Please don't take me down. Please don't take me down. Did you be dank? A collab with Siren. Found craft. And the reason it looks a bit silly is because hang on. I've forgotten what the strength is. It's a double IPA, obviously with Tiny Rebel. 8.4% and it's murky. Missing. Fruit bomb, really fruit bomb. Actually refreshing, fruity, well hidden alcohol, that's a big plus plus. Hey. Magic rock, sour passion, 4.7% alcohol by volume, had his fingers finest, I think this is going to be my last. Oh wow. Happy birthday. I think you'll understand. Anyway. Follow the babe. Which is brains from a long time ago. There's a hell of a lot of lime in the aroma. Which is good because the ingredients say lime. A little lime in the body. Sour, tart, fruity, slightly acidic. And incredibly refreshing. B plus plus. <laughs> 